Hi everybody, it's me Verity and welcome back to my YouTube channel or if you've never seen me before, hello I'm Verity and I like to make gaming content, mostly The Sims 4 but I will sprinkle some other games in once in a while. Just a quick reminder, if you are enjoying my videos, please like them, it helps me more than you'd know and if you are a new or returning viewer, please think about subscribing to my channel. Now that I've got all the formalities out of the way, what is this you're building, I hear you cry? This is not a K-pop build. Well, I'm doing something a little different this week. As you may or may not know, I'm currently playing the Not So Berry Challenge. I'll link the playlist down below. And we're only on Mint Gen episode 4, so it will be really easy for y'all to catch up. I'm... I love the Taiwanese in The Sims 4, however... Once you've played 1700 times with the same Taiwanese, it does get a bit repetitive. So I'm going to make a save file for my Not So Berry challenge and I'm going to be renovating lots, changing lots, making like I have come dine with me, whatever it's called. And like none of the packs, none of the worlds in the game even have like a restaurant in them. So we're going to be building restaurants. We're going to be building bowling alleys, you know, just stuff that isn't usually in the game. And if it is in the game, we'll make it a little better. So I'm going to be adding my own Sims to each of the builds. So for example, the lot I'm building now is going to be like a trailer park, a live-in trailer park. We don't really have these in the UK, but I was thinking kind of like 8 Mile, you know? Like, maybe not 8 Mile, because these aren't trailers as such, they are stuck to the ground. Because I did try and use the trailer wheels that came with base game, and I spent longer than I would like to admit trying to find those trailer wheels. I cut it all out from the start of the video, but it was probably about 20 minutes of pure Vezzy scrolling through debug, going past them, never seeing them. Yeah, so love that. Um, f took me about 20 minutes to find them and then I didn't end up using them in the first place. In the first place, is that? I didn't end up using them in the first place. That doesn't make sense to me, but let's not think about old timely sayings now. So I'm currently building the first lot which I decided this one belongs to like an elderly couple. They don't have a lot of money but they try and keep the place nice but the decor is a little bit old-fashioned. I wanted to build a different trailer for different types of people so for instance, this first one is an elderly couple. The next one is like a proper nerdy guy who builds cars and rarely leaves the house. Um, we've got a single lady living on her own and she's made the interior and exterior of her house really, really pretty. She doesn't have a lot of money, but the money that she has got, she's used to make the outside of her tiny house look beautiful. And then I'm like, what other stereotypical people can I have? So I started to build another trailer and then I was talking to my friend and she said like the erratic guy, the, the trope of the erratic guy. And I thought that's a good idea, but very similar to the guy who never leaves the house. So instead, what I've gone with is like, he's built his own house, um, everything is mismatched, he is really into the Strangerville conspiracy theories, and yeah, everything, he's really fit, he builds everything himself, I forgot to give him a bathroom, but then at the end you'll see I built him like this bathroom, he's built his own bath, he's built his own toilet, why don't we have a build your own sink in The Sims? annoying because we've had to use one that like where have you had that one from hun um he's got the strangerville workout gear you know and then the last one was a build for a single mom with a child she i don't know she's got interests her favorite color is orange you'll see you'll see 
So we've moved on to the second trailer now. As I said, this is the guy who he builds cars. Well, I don't know if he builds cars, but he definitely rips them to pieces, you know? You know? Here you can see I found the debug cars from Strangerville. I'm only using base game in Strangerville in this build. Whatever world I'm in, I will only use the pack that came with that build so that if anyone does want to download the save file, I mean, sure, go for it. It'll have my sims in it. Um, but if you did want to download it, you'd be able to, even if you didn't have all the packs, which, you know, I'm being friendly. Friendly Vessi, you don't get that often. I'm just sat here right now drinking a lovely cup of tea. My tea is not staying warm as much as I'd like it to, if I'm completely honest, because the UK right now is freezing. It's been snowing. It's been like minus seven degrees. I'm not having a nice time. Honestly, I look really cute. I've, I cut my hair last week. I've got a little bob now. I ma made myself a fringe. I didn't. I asked my friend to cut my hair and she said no and I thought you know what you're not going to cut my hair but if I cut my own hair you're gonna have to make it nicer for me and my evil plan worked so while we were there she's always refused to give me a fringe but she gave me bangs and oh, when I'm out in the cold with my little earmuffs on not to toot my own horn but my little cheeks and my little nose goes red and I look adorable yep just putting that out there but yeah it's been like minus seven and my tea it usually stays warm for like an hour I'm 25 minutes tops tops I'm, I'm not I'm not having a nice time with it going back to every tiny house is a letter of the alphabet and each letter of the alphabet is a different k-pop group if you've been following that series you'll know that i did gravity last week and i didn't know anything about them it was difficult for me i mean i really enjoyed it i i wasn't failing at life because how could i i don't know anything about them but i equally don't know anything about d for i don't know day six dream catcher you know i don't know anything about any groups beginning with d so if you've been following that build challenge and you know a k-pop group that begins with d and they're like your bias group let me know hit me up give me some details and i will do d for whatever group you know oh i found these um, wet patches and I thought this guy he's disgusting he's gonna have these all over his wall like it was too clean and white for me you know but I've not given up on my k-pop challenge I'm looking forward to E for an hypen yeah I've already decided which k-pop group I'm doing for each letter and E is gonna be an hypen because I mean honestly I was thinking about doing it this week because the goth galore goth galore the goth galore pack has just come out the kit and if you know Vezzy, then you know that she was an emo in her time not quite a goth but she was full-on emo kid and that pack although it's a little punky for my liking it does speak to me on a spiritual level now i am more of a builder than a cast simmer but the castle kit just doesn't do it for me there's only one lot in the whole of the sims 4 that you can really build a cattle on a cattle oh yes let me build a cow a castle on and um it's the one with the maze from windenburg beautiful lot great for a castle but also what am i putting on the inside give me some interior if you're going to give me a castle kit I think I voted for the futuristic kit for that one, but I did definitely vote for the goth kit because little little Vezzy living her uh, ideal past. Where was I going with that whole conversation? Bear with me. This will happen a lot. Goth. Oh, yes. I nearly did E for Enhypen because I'm like, them kids those little babies they're they're little vampires i've seen yeah yeah they are living in a twilight movie they are little sewer rats yeah and i'm a sewer rat don't get it twisted i am team 
Edward Cullen. And I was in the bath the other day, or was I in bed? And I was thinking, I'm definitely Team Edward. And then I thought, wait a hot second, Team Jacob? What's Jacob's surname? If you can remind me, because it's been days now, if you can remind me what Jacob's surname is, is it like Wolf? Jacob Wolf? No. J- Jacob... It, whatever. I was always Team Edward Cullen. But those little and hyping babies, they are vampires. And I am looking forward to doing a gothic build. And... I mean, the casket will not come in handy at all for that, but I thought it was all in keeping, you know. Right now on this build, we are in the single lady's house and she likes pink. Yeah, she likes pink. She likes pastel. She's made it really nice inside, like I said. But she doesn't have a lot of money, but she spends it on her interior and exterior. Yeah, I went plenty. And while I was building this, I was watching streams of Among Us because, hello little boy, please don't walk on my keyboard. I love you, but please don't walk on my keyboard. You okay? You, yeah, she doing some singing. And we love it when you sing. No more? You gonna sing some more? Oh, beautiful. Yes, um, the cat did walk on my keyboard and the cat did stop my recording. Love that for me. I was only talking to the cat really, so you didn't miss anything. I've put him on the floor now. He hates it there. He likes it on mommy's lap. But if you're going to walk on my keyboard, little man, no. Well, I can't very well remember what I was talking about now, can I? Was it Among Us? It's going to be now. I like to watch Among Us streams I know, I know, I'm stuck in I'm stuck in COVID times. I loved playing Among Us in COVID times. Gosh, on furlough, playing Among Us. Perfect. Yeah, but they have this um I'm I haven't played since 2020, so please forgive me. I've been watching the streams with the better crew link mod and now I'm watching people playing hide and seek and my anxiety cannot handle that not in a million years would i be able to play hide and seek on stream or on my own no uh the music it's a no from vesey but i'm like is that part of the game now or is that like just part of the better crew link mod if you could let me know that would be great drop me a comment let me know if you want to play among us with me let me know i have one friend who plays among us i need at least eight more thank you yes yeah, so i'm putting flowers outside this house because you know i can't keep them alive myself i am a, a plant failure but as a taurus i am an earth sim and i just i just love plants and flowers i like to look at them they make the house feel alive so i do have plastic ones everywhere they don't need keeping alive you know you'll see that i add uh, baby yoda into his house obviously i've added like painting chess computers i want each sim to have at least one activity to do because you can't just be in your house you know i know what sims are like they will just be in the house oh i found some more deep debug landscape in here and i know what you're saying plants can't live in the desert well she waters them okay is that good enough for you she waters them those cactuses those cacti yeah they they stay alive on their own and that those flowers next to the chess table they came with strangerville so shut up i don't want to hear it they came with the desert pack okay and strangerville was a hundred percent modeled off stranger things right and it just makes me really sad that the mother wasn't like bella goth the mother if you don't know spoiler alert spoiler alert she's a great big plant a purple one but a great big plant nonetheless and i am a plant child i am a taurus i've already said that 
but I don't appreciate the bad guy being a plant. That is all I'm going to say about it. Um, so it's Saturday when I'm filming this, and House Flipper is on sale, guys. And I know what you're going to say. If you know me, then you know I already own House Flipper on my on my Switch. But if I bought it on my PC, would you watch it with me? If I bought it and played it and posted it on YouTube, would you watch it? Because I love that game. I'm a Sims builder, which equally makes me a house flipper, you know? And while we're talking about other games that I can play, Animal Crossing, how would you feel about that? I could do some decorating on, on the on the DLC, you know? And, hmm, what other games do I like to play? Unpacking, love that. I done that on stream the other week. If you didn't see it, then it's no biggie. Only four people did, but I love that game. Stardew Valley is an obvious one. Oh, can we talk about the build that I'm doing right now? Because that one with the green car, the teal car, the cyan car, sus, that is the orange house and I hadn't fully decided what was going to go in that house, but this is when I'd spoken to my friend and I was like, this guy's going to have two of those smaller buildings and they're going to connect together. So here Vesley is looking through debug. Can she very well find anything to join those houses? <sighs> Golly gosh, the music scared me then. I thought lo fi wasn't meant to be scary. <sighs> gosh, my anxiety, it's like hide and seek all over again. Can she very well find anything to join these houses together? No, she cannot. But does she? Possibly. Here we go again. <coughs> but then can she also just build a little corridor for said creepy man who lives here yeah and does she 100 percent, she does um yeah um another bit that scared me when the symbol went off just then is that my cat jumped back onto the desk and i was like heck what have you just trodden on what have you done little sir his name is chester but he goes by many names including smorgasbord because if you don't know his name is Chester, Chester Barrington. That's what my dad calls him. He's named after Chester from Lincoln Park because he was basically born on the day that that man killed himself. And if you hadn't been listening earlier, you know that I was a little emo kid. So in year eight, yes, in year eight, I loved Lincoln Park. I loved them. Lincoln Park and Eminem. Yeah, it was one of those. So I named my cat Chester and he he started off as chester then he was called satan because he was a very naughty little kitten yes he got up he got into mischief and from satan we had little sir and then from little sir it kind of was little sir small boy you know small boy small boy turned into smallest boy which turned into smorgas boy so that's why my channel's called what it is we've named the channel after my best friend smorgas board yes little boy he goes by anything really and he's an indoor cat because he's persian if you watched my not so berry challenge from friday just gone episode four he did he done a little debut in there he did some singing he got his little picture where he wanted it for everyone to see so he's not allowed outside because have you seen his face i'd never see him again someone would steal him and he'd get so knotty and and hit those little balls that are from a plant they'd get stuck in his phone and we would all hate that but when he does sneak outside, because he does think that he's an outdoor cat, he's always looking out of the window and don't come at me. He's an indoor cat and he likes it inside. He likes it. He thinks he's an outdoor cat until he's outside. He, he has no street smarts. Uh, every single time apart from once that he snuck outside. Oh my gosh, I've lost my, my little Chester pus. I do always find him and you know where he always is? Of course he is. He's in the garage. He only ever makes it to the garage. He doesn't have street smarts and you know who else is in the garage? My hedgehogs. I have a mother and three baby hedgehogs living in my garage. 
jealous i know right and i don't see them often but sometimes we like to go in there don't we little sir and we like to see them yeah i'm still building this house for this creepy old man i don't know what that thing is in like the background the brown thing that i've placed there but i was like water tower i thought as well i have the full rent pack but obviously i'm only building with strangerville and the base game but if you have the rent pack and you wanted to download this you could make each one of these a different apartment you know and that would be fun to play you'd have neighbors imagine that in the sims 4 so i just took a little break to go make myself another cup of tea it's like my fifth cup of tea this morning i say this morning it's like half past one but you know and i'm i just why won't they stay warm i hate that oh we're on little miss orange house now she just she just really likes orange and she's got a son and i think I think in my head when I was designing this house for this mother and the son he is like almost a teen he's a preteen we don't have the age group in the sims but if we did he'd be a preteen about to be a teenager and don't worry I swap their car for the orange one I'm not a psychopath you know but tomorrow is Sunday and I have an errand to run I know I've got such a busy weekend ahead of me I have to meal prep I know right meal prep I'm making breakfast muffins and a frittata what's one of those sounds very much like an omelette and it does scare me I'm very scared of food by the way I've got some safe foods that I haven't eaten for a long time Bernard Matthews Kiev's haven't had them for like over a year and hot dogs I love pizza I've bought like I've been making pita pizza because they're a bit healthier but you don't care about my safe foods what you do care about is that my dad has asked me to take him to the train station tomorrow because he is going to go to Londinium to see the hologram Abba in concert I know what hologram Abba I've never heard of anything so ridiculous in my life sounds awful i haven't given him a definite answer as to whether i'm going to take him because i don't know that i can allow such behavior to happen but yeah we all know that i'm going to take him he's a delight i love my dad pappy oh, i'm placing rocks now i was like what can this middle part be i found some massive and i'm not even lying i sized them down boulders and i'm like yeah this can be a little trailer park built around these strangerville boulders why not who doesn't love a boulder i tell you who have you ever tried to lift one Dwayne the boulder i can't remember what i've talked about already because when i was drinking my like 10th cup of tea i i can't remember what we've already spoken about you know we could talk about you now from 80s but we do that a lot anyway here's my boulders see i sized them down and then what else could i put here in the next build i'm not gonna stay in strangerville i think i might go to hmm maybe i'll renovate like the bff household or the pancakes or something here's that bathroom that i forgot to build you remember you remember when we spoke about that and there's the um bathtub that he's like built himself oh and i've given him the windows with the shutters because i'm like where would he find perfect windows from he's built this house himself there's the toilet i just had to go with that sink it really bothers me but i found that mirror and i'm like he thrifted that it's a little sad cloud mirror i know but where is he getting windows from so i know that there's windows behind them but in our heads in our heads when we're playing that's just shutters um but we've almost finished with the speed build now and i'm just doing the finishing touches but if you've made it to this point already please give it a like again i really appreciate it and subscribe to the channel if you enjoy this kind of content but for now i will see you on friday for episode five of the not so berry challenge bye